we're just kind of showing there is an alternative to just buying a lot of quick, quick cheap disposable clothes by repairing and mending and keeping things and kind of loving them back to life. So at the moment, kind of all over the country, in about 50 cities in this country and about 15 other countries, uh, on the same day, there's lovely little lines of people like this one, all just on their local high streets, mending their clothes. And also we've been given a very easy alternative choice, which is to kind of just consume. It's easy, it's quick, it's, you know, become very desirable and I think we just have to sort of change the mindset a bit to that to realise that sewing and mending is far more than about fixing things because you, you can't afford anything else it is about the sort of lovely contract you can have with your clothes and like any relationship it just becomes more valuable and more sustainable and purposeful the longer it lasts. A really important message particularly for kids even, younger kids I was never ever a seamstress, but I was able to fix things. And I've actually gotten out of the habit of that over the years. Recently I've done more of it, and, it, and it's because people have reminded me that it's better to repair these things. And also because there are clothes I have I really like, and I don't, I don't want to get rid of them. 